Alrighty, boys and girls. Well, so, so exciting right now to see Bitcoin at 69k500 closing in into that 70k. Probably did hit that in some exchanges. And uh, it seems like we might actually have put in the bottom. That 54k here is possibly the bottom. And if we look at this uh, bull market support band, which is basically shows you if we are in a bull market uh, uptrend or a downtrend, which is uh, called a bear market or whatever. So what we've seen here now, uh, in the past what happened is bitcoin hit that 30k right here and then went below it for a while and this was like the 24k everybody calling for bottoms that said that was a dead cat bounce a bear trap or whatever and now we're seeing the same thing playing out guys this is very 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 important and actually i'm i'm feeling really bullish right now right like um we can't get more confirmation than this and you can see it here right so it did actually go below it let me put on a different chart for you here so we did actually go below it as you can see here which is not the greatest thing to see right but we then came into these lows which something we've seen previously with bitcoin and bitcoin loves to do that and here as i shown you guys you see that went below it everybody got bearish and then above it and that like that weekly green candle here monstrous weekly green candles after it got reclaimed and now it's reclaimed again right you see this previous week right last week we retested it and then now we're moving ahead forward so this is actually showing us that bitcoin still got that strength this is definitely a bull market that is unprecedented right it's like a lot of things happened in this bull market that left everyone second guessing everything and uh it was pretty much unclear the whole way right if you were here from the beginning or from 2021 or whatever you see that it wasn't clear from the beginning we were slowly climbing this wall of worry on bitcoin and it was still kind of every time we get a dip people were screaming that said it's over 40k or whatever like they say now at the highs it wasn't the easiest uptrend ever to be looking at, right? But sometimes we just need to look at the chart and cut out the noise and uh, just look at things like objectively and what we have. And objectively looking at Bitcoin chart today, it just looks super bullish. And we have one more thing, right? So Solana is actually now going towards the $200 in its um, price and broke out as well as we didn't see a big, big move from each, which is understandable after Grayscale ETF. Now they have finally the opportunity to start selling their discounted ETF that they bought back in the days and which it is gonna get its time as well but what i want to show you here is the most important factor of this all is the bitcoin dominance so uh, if you were here back in the days you probably remember this but whenever bitcoin dominance moves strongly with bitcoin this is usually how bull market starts that's why i titled this video like prepare for the bull market because it's literally we have all the signs now like everything is pumping like bitcoin is pumping with the bitcoin dominance which is a good sign bitcoin moves only when big big whales are buying and big whales usually are the smartest people right they know more they have more connections and whatnot so there are a lot of factors but the simple way to explain this is when bitcoin dominance is pumping with bitcoin is usually that's how bit a bull market starts now there is one more thing i want to show you here guys which is very interesting right so if you go to google trends this is actually how i know people's behavior and i see what the markets are doing and i understand what people are doing and if you remember guys here i told you that most people bought the top and i'm gonna show you now why i know that and how did i know that so you you can see here guys now this is a cryptocurrency trend on google trend if you search for it here and it shows you how much people are searching for it so you can see here guys this is 2020 before the bull market where we are now nothing was happening for a long time it was just trending like sideways nothing is happening this is these are actually real people searching for cryptocurrency right and in 2021 it slowly started trending up so to february early 2021 it started peaking and you were still early and then it peaked at its high here it peaked in 2021 right that that was it right that was like the peak of the bull market and then it just crashed but you know when we seen this huge increase you know that people outside of us outside of the crypto space are buying crypto right now because they're searching for it they they still learning they want to know more right and each cycle we get more people staying in so you see the floor here is a bit above the previous one the 2021 but what i want to tell you here is look at this peak here this is actually between the third and the night or it's like let's say early march 2024 this is the peak or the highest we've had since a long time since actually late 
2022, literally one year and a half later, we got a high after almost two years more interest in the crypto space. And this actually happened early March. So what's happened in early March, guys? Early March, that was Bitcoin. This is the 11th where Bitcoin put a new all-time high. That was literally the 11th of March. So you can't make this up. People were searching for that at the high, right? At the high here. They were searching for Bitcoin. Or they were searching for cryptocurrency. They wanted to know more. They bought the top. And that's why I've been telling you guys, people, a lot of people now bought the top and they are the loudest right now because they are the ones at the biggest losses right now because they did buy the top right so when we started this this whole major trend when we bought pp when we bought a lot of coins like even caspa here and stuff like that that people now are interested into nobody looked into the crypto space back then right so this is october end of 2023 this is actually the lowest point of interest in the crypto space that was the end of 2023 and i'm gonna tell you i'm gonna come to why i'm telling you this now and why you are still early here today coming up into this bull market is very important to know right now this is actually showing you real data what people are actually doing right now so you can be early right this whole thing is you being early before the next guy that's how it works so this is literally showing you that right now so you see here guys this is june this is summer 2023 Twen summer 2023 and this was pepe coming up a lot of coins coming up people buying up a lot of good coins that you that you see here today at four billion five billion dollars and here in this peak here this is end of 2023 we had dog we've had bong we had a lot of meme coins and coins old coins pumping and people making a lot of money and people now sitting on real real comfortable profits and look at what was happening with the trend nobody looked into it like literally nobody looked into it when did they look is when bitcoin broke all-time high so this is it right the peak and this is actually when we got most of the people tuning in most of the views on youtube most of people on twitter getting followers most of the people loud and searching and looking for cryptocurrency and they came in late right they came in late and the people that bought in here they were the early guys right they were early guys if you were here with me from back in the days you are early on almost everything right and now if you bought in here you are late but you are uh, in luck today you are in luck we are headed into a bull market now and when you are looking at this you ask yourself right in this game of crypto right what's the most important thing the main main important thing besides the bubble maps and uh, the team and and the fundamentals and this is ai and this is meme coin and this is narratives and this the most important is that you are early it doesn't matter the coin could be the worst coin in the world but if you are early enough you will make money on that coin so that's it right like that's literally the most important thing you want to know is are you early right so now we're seeing bitcoin bullish everything is bullish whereas looking at a real strong healthy market like everything is bouncing even though like your favorite meme coins or old coins are not gonna be straight up pumping now 1000 x because bitcoin is pumping it's normal right they are gonna have to wait before bitcoin actually breaks a, a new all-time high reaches that max pain or max price where everybody's gonna be damn it man i'm buying now right so to get back to this people haven't tuned in yet right people are still out there people are still doing whatever they're doing right the usual thing they're doing or whatever we're seeing the interest at its lowest right now right interest at its lowest it's only us here looking at the crypto space right now arguing with each other is this the bull market is this the bear market Market. is this gonna keep going up is this gonna keep going down while everybody's doing that right they're all forgetting about this right this is the google trend this is actually people that are gonna come buy our bags right these are these people here so these people are not interested the people that came in in march 2024 they possibly left right or sold the bottom right sold the bottom or if they are holding now they are mad now they are mad like oh my god oh, uh, this bottom is not it we're keep going we're gonna keep going down because if they say right they will only watch bearish stuff because now now they change their bias they 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 think now crypto is a scam we bought the top everything is going down that's it but what they don't know is they're still early actually the people that bought here are still early and people that are buying now are still early because what we really are betting on now or what is the bull market basically is bitcoin pumping and creating this right this is actually when people are searching for cryptocurrency they are not interested in bitcoin they're not really that's not what they're searching for they're actually searching for altcoins that's the altcoin season that's like the main phase of the cycle so when this started to peak guys it started in like early 2021 january 
2021 and then it started pumping and then here so it was like a dip here from march 2021 to peak which was may right so this was actually like two three months of like the actual altcoin season the actual everything is pumping what doing 100 x's and stuff so we're still far away from that we're literally here now right we're here you see this little peak here and then we dumped a little bit and the people got disinterested and this was the best time to buy so now we're seeing the same thing like the best time to buy was right september 2022 october but now the second best time is here it's today right or right before we see this now we don't know exactly when this is gonna start to peak and people are gonna start to get interested and and that's one more question that people ask you people like certainty people like guarantees and people like to know when sir right i want to know the exact moment and all we're doing here is actually we're trying to figure out that that exactly right we're trying to understand what's happening in the market we're looking at the data what people are doing and we're trying to understand what's happening we cannot guarantee or have a certain time frame when this is going to happen all we can say is bitcoin needs to keep pumping until it reaches that price right we don't know what that price is exactly but it needs to keep going up and the charts are showing that bitcoin is going to keep going up so that's the most important now the last time we've seen the increasing trend people looking people buying up altcoins pp going from below 1 billion to 1 billion and a half 5 billion everything pumping or you remember that previous massive altcoin meme coin season it happened right here when bitcoin was going up towards this new fresh all-time high and people started buying the top on everything so now wherever that price bitcoin needs to reach which in my opinion it should be right above 80k or between 90 to 80k and this is when we are gonna start to see the actual trend flipping right people actually searching people are gonna tune in right people are gonna start searching and then they're gonna start finding a large variety of altcoins meme coins each their their own thing right like they'll find gaming coins someone talking about them they'll find other coins people talking about them they'll come to me they'll find me talking about meme coins they'll come and they'll find the people that you see today wherever trending coins those are the most most likely coins to be picked up by these people because what they do is they search online they find something and that's what they buy right that's why they say attention economy cryptocurrencies they need attention they need eyes they need people talking about them they need that and this and that and this right if even if they have the best best utility the world has ever seen if nobody's talking about them they would not pump so this brings me guys to the same thing i've been saying over and over and over right whatever trending coins that are going to keep trending and you want to just find the best narratives that are most likely to keep trending and people are going to jump on and then their derivatives right like the pay verse and stuff like that right and that's what we're still waiting for we still have i still have the target for pepe which is around 50 billion or even more we can even see a crazy crazy bull market now we don't know really what's, what we're gonna witness but usually when this bitcoin dominance reverses right that's when we start to see the altcoin season and one of the biggest ones right and one last thing here guys is how do you know we're gonna get a even bigger bigger altcoin season right so the numbers we've seen previously shiba you know going to 50 billion and dogecoin almost 100 billion each cycle we get even bigger numbers right it's just a liquidity and more money is injected into the into the economy and more people actually might, uh, have more money and people grow up and save up and whatever right a lot of things that are in this economy right in the dynamic of this economy that are playing that increases liquidity the global liquidity and money and people are having more money and inflation and all that stuff right so each cycle we get even bigger return right when it comes to old coins right bitcoin have have, have diminishing returns but old coins fresh old coins fresh new narratives that's why always talk about that fresh new coins of this cycle they haven't seen the pump in the previous cycles those they outperform the previous cycle coins right the, the ones that had already a pump they make even bigger pumps right so what we, we what we can do is add others right so others is by now you probably know what that is but others is all old coins besides the top 10 right top 10 me uh, old coins and if we add them here and you'll see now what, what i'm talking about so this is tracking literally tracking the bitcoin dominance so whenever bitcoin dominance reverses you see the altcoin season this is the besides the top 10 so everything else everything down to the 100k market cap coin so this starts when bitcoin dominance reverses right and here this is the 2017 right so bitcoin collapsed like the bitcoin dominance collapsed and then we had um pump right let me show you that here 
we had a pump, right? This is the 2017. This is this is XRP, right? This is Bitcoin Cash, Litecoin, right? So EOS, what are the people that have been here? You see how tiny it is? And then this is the 21, the 2021 one. So look at the 2021 bull market or altcoin season. So Bitcoin dominance reverses and this one go ham, go crazy, right? And way bigger than the 2017 one. Way, 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 way bigger. Like this is 10 times bigger or more. And now you are having the same thing or like now we're seeing the same same thing besides something very new this cycle is that people are front running the altcoin season you can see the bitcoin dominance is going up but also others has been going up the whole time now recently since march right look at that since march 11th of march right when everybody came in here to search they bought the top that's why i'm telling you right so look at that it topped right there 11th of march and then it started going down while the bitcoin dominance is keep going up right so just because people are front running this this thing right people now are more excited than ever because they seen 2021 right they now oh bitcoin is pumping let me buy those quick but just to show you this is this kept going up while the bitcoin dominance is going up this means we're gonna go way higher once this reverses back the bitcoin dominance reverses back others will skyrocket way way before way above 2021 so whatever craziness we've seen in 2021 we're gonna see now double that right double that and especially on new narrative coins this is very important if the coin already done a market cycle or gone through a market cycle gone through a bull market before it already has done that right and it doesn't mean it's gonna outperform itself from that 2021 peak it does not mean that it just means that pepe let's say is a new narrative coin it's a new meme coin of this cycle everybody wants it because now it hasn't gone through that and shiba inu is a previous cycle meme coin right it's gonna outperform the performance of shiba inu in 2021 let's say that way right it's gonna outperform that because that's we see all the time happening double time so just to recap guys and wrap up you see now why everybody bought the top here if you did that if you are one of those people just so you know don't get mad calm down right the crypto space is like that just learn use this time to learn and understand when you see yourself interested in crypto only when it's green and pumping then right you need to fix that now right get interested when it's red when it's dumping when it's going down right like that's now oh that's opportunity i'm buying cheap i'm early right you can go to google trends everybody has access to this this is free right crypto trends the google trends cryptocurrency worldwide right worldwide and check what's happening right are we early i see this thing here whatever coin you buy you're early to that coin right just make sure people are talking about it it's gonna stay around and all that stuff and that's it right hands off like you buy it and your hands off you, you you stay on your hands right you sit on your hands and wait right because this is gonna come and you see this peak here we've seen a lot of coin going to billions of dollars and we haven't even had like the real actually people looking and searching we didn't have that so imagine this like this is coming right this massive spike up is coming and that's what we're betting on what these people are gonna do right that's how we try to predict the future are these people what they're gonna do right what what's most likely gonna catch their attention right is it your revolutionary utility rwa d pin stuff or is it the green frog everybody's talking about or is it that meme coin that everybody's talking about right like even caspa or like you have your utility coins like terra luna classic those are that are, are actually now more behaving like a meme coin like people are actually talking about they love it they have a good community and stuff like that they're everywhere everybody's talking about them like you want your utility coin if you're like i'm not getting into meme coins at least if you are getting into a, a utility coin make sure people are talking about make sure people are interested into it make sure that there is a community people are interested into it they they talk about it they tell you their friends about it and if you make a simple youtube search people are talking about it, or a simple twitter search people are talking about it, then you're right you're fine because you're still early right like at the peak here you want you don't want to do that because then it means if everybody's talking about it you're late but now you're early right now now it's actually easy mode this is the time where you buy whatever and it goes up and then that's when actually people become more arrogant and start to think they're smart and they were born for this and that's it like they're geniuses because whatever they do it works Works, right and they start buying everything and that's the top usually so and that's still still far away ahead from us, right still still far away we're here we're like literally 2020 october 2020 and then this peaked in may 2021 so our peak is possibly around the same time frame right same time frame around may april that's what i've been saying and then we had a second top here 
like even though the interest you see the interest wasn't there the interest wasn't there that's why the whole market didn't pump as it should but we had a few coins pumping doing new highs 100 x's and stuff happening here and this was the second peak and this was november 2021 right and as you can see the time frame is still long right you just don't want to miss the first one right that's the most important and you want to get ready here so which i think if you've been following around you now ready you understand the narratives that we've got going on right now the paper verse narrative and you understand what the market wants and that's it literally so i hope this was helpful guys don't forget to join my discord in the description if you want more information if you want to get in early on stuff if you want to join people that are actually hustling every day looking at these markets in the trenches doing stuff like that it's free to join link in the description also follow me on twitter i keep you updated every day as well as don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you on the next one cheers